Hey everyone, this video is sponsored once again by Manscaped. Shout out to them. Um, use my code DRICE20 to get 20% off your order. They have a cologne that actually smells really good and it comes free with the Perfect Package 2.0. So if you buy the Perfect Package 2.0, you get the cologne for free or you can just buy it on its own. The cologne has everything that a man needs to get started on his path to easy, safe grooming. The cologne doesn't fade and it's made with all natural ingredients. So go check it out, order it, use my code DRICE20. Get me spit bookie. I'm gonna hand them my spit bookie. Tell them to go back and spit shine that belt and bring it back here. They're ready for me to take it. Are you ready for this I'm fight? Ready to go. I'm ready for war. You know that. Today we are kicking off the world championship press tour. I own this town, yeah. If this was a different time, I would invade his favela on horseback and kill anyone that was not fit to walk. Respect, I respect, I don't care who it is. But when you come there, respect is over. Then I come and win. Yeah, what's he gonna do? <laughs> it looks good, right? No, no. Say goodbye. No, no, I said, I am his dad. I own this town. I own Rio de Janeiro. Give me that. Special in that. Sit on my back. What's he gonna do? You wanna do something? Faltou um bicho em cima dele, pra se arrepender. One king gets old. He starts getting sloppy, he starts stagnating. Then a young gorilla comes up and kills him and takes everything in the arm. He's not holding you back. 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 Let's go let it close up. Don't, don't touch. Close up. Let's go close up. All I smell is pussy. Keep giving your fucking what's up, everybody? Yes. Okay, Beverly. He has 25 minutes to run, 25 minutes to hide that bow one chin, and nobody can hide that chin from me. I Bye. 
crazy or what? Smiley, smiley. 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 Deixa a frente, a frente, vou arrancar a cabeça dele fora, né? deixa ele ver. Ele pode falar quando tá longe. Lá dentro não vai falar nada. This is what you call a rude awakening. É. He broke his fucking rib. Oh my god. We've spent a lot of money promoting this fight. A lot of people are excited about the fight, so uh, it's definitely disappointing. Had a little tiny bruise, <clears throat> and panic set in. Fear set in. So, doctors have revealed that he's a pussy. Aldo's rib is, is too painful, and uh, he will not be fighting. So, Chad Mendez now will fight Conor McGregor for the interim belt. It means nothing to me, the result will remain the same. It doesn't matter who was in front of me. I am the pound for pound number one, so whoever is standing across from me will get it. Uh, if a man is scared for his life, we cannot force him to step inside and face me, you know. I feel he is afraid. The doctors have cleared him to fight. It's a bruise, but he has still pulled out. So, rightfully so, the belt should be taken from him and we should uh, contest for the interim belt, or, in my opinion, the real belt. I just feel he was beaten me mentally before I had the chance to beat him physically. Uh, you're still going to fight, but you're going to fight Chad Mendez. How do you think you match up with Chad? I'm gonna demolish him. Um, I'm gonna rip his head off. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Connects with he tagged him with two big punches there, Mike. It's a big back kick. It's nice. If you look at the, the baddest dudes in the division, it's Aldo McGregor, uh, Mendez, and uh, Edgar. So I talked to Frankie Edgar. Yeah. And he said that he spoke to Connor and he said, hey, I want the shot before you fight Aldo because we never know when he's coming back. Is that something that you would say, all right, this makes sense? No. What's next That then? makes no sense whatsoever. That, all right, so what, what makes sense for you? Jose Aldo versus Connor McGregor makes sense. This one will be a spectacle. This one will be a master class. This one will be the changing of a guard. Me bringing in a new era in fighting, in approach, in everything. I think he's a clown. He likes to talk a lot and he likes to make people laugh, but that's about it, you know? And um, I, I'm, I'm really sorry that I couldn't fight him the last time. And when, when it comes time, time to fight him now, I'm gonna kick his ass. It will be over before you know it.
it up. It's red panty night when you decide to find me, yeah? Who the f is that guy? I operate on my own time. Sorry, I'm late. I just don't give up. This is what big Irish look like. He has mentioned he would love to have another fight against Conor at lightweight. Again, you know, no shortage of opponents for Conor McGregor, but uh, I'd like to see that one. I I'd like to see that one. When you knock a champion who's been that dominant and that good for 10 years out in 14 seconds, 13. there is the question, there is a question, which is, was that in some ways a fluke? Did you think, see the video of him again. warming up in the dressing room? He was preparing exactly for that maneuver. Yeah, he threw a cross on my chest, which I wasn't expected. Then I threw a punch, and he came back with another cross, and that was that. I think that we need the rematch. It was really not a fight, so we need to get back in here. Many Brazilian fans are going to say, hey, that's a fluke. Would you give Jose Aldo a rematch? Yeah, I, 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 I would. Go! No.